I am the topic of conversation. It's a celebration. Let's toast to the fact that I moved out my mama basement. To a so this is my vision board. Who knew they knew it's new, new. Hi you guys, if you are new to my channel, I wanna say hey, and if you're returning, welcome back. Y'all, I need to figure out what to do with my hair, but that's off topic. But for today's to-do list, we have to make a Target run. Then after the Target run, I also have to get some stuff to make the vision boards. And then after the vision boards, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do after that, but I'll keep you guys updated. And we're gonna figure out as it goes. So let's make a run. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, go bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who's stopping? It's the feeling that I get when we lock up. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I feel your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your ease on the pencil. And here you go, you try to tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my nigga, girl. Hey y'all, so I know the camera quality is really bad and y'all probably noticed I pulled my tent off this window but I actually decided to go to Walgreens and get the stuff and then I just picked up my Target order as you guys saw. I'm actually on the way home to get started on cooking this meal that I have planned and prepped for you guys. Um, I'll tell you guys more about it once I get home. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. I'm finally back home, guys, and I'm about to get started. So I didn't tell you guys what I'm cooking, but I am cooking a chicken pot pie. So I never cooked this before, and it's going to basically kind of be from scratch. So let's see how it turns out. Right now, I'm about to open the chicken breast, um, wash it off and season it, and then I'm going to saute it. And I'll show you guys a little bit what that is exactly. All right, guys, so I finished seasoning the chicken and washing it, and now I'm about to get started on cooking it. I'm gonna pour a little bit of olive oil in there. Okay, and this is my chicken. Just gonna lay it on there. As you guys can see, I am finished almost with cooking the chicken, but my mom is gonna get started with shredding the chicken. So I'm gonna set you guys up so you guys can see her do that really quick. As you guys saw, my mom finished shredding up the chicken, so now I'm gonna get started on the sauce. So first I'm gonna add a one third of butter. The butter is melting, so now I'm going to add the one third of flour. Now I'm just going to stir it in. And then the one third of milk. And then, so now I'm adding one third of chicken broth in there. One and three fourths. One and three fourths of chicken broth. We're adding a half a teaspoon into here of salt. So now I'm adding one fourth table teaspoon. One fourth. Ugh. So now I'm adding one fourth teaspoon of pepper. So this is what the sauce looks like. So now we're just waiting for it to thicken. So once it thickens, we'll be back. All right, so we're about to add the vegetables. Mm 
Okay, now we're gonna stir it in. Now we are adding the cream of chicken cheese. Guys, so I'm about to add the chicken into here slowly. This is the stuff in the inside. I'm about to get ready to make the pot pie. This shit was all I knew. You and me only. I did it all for you. Still you. I am the topic of conversation. It's a celebration. Tell me that you never heard none of my songs. Long as you end up saying one day you plan to listen. Cause what's a star when it's most this important fan is missing? I knew, you and me only. I did it all for you. Still you were lonely. We could have worked it out. Oh, but I guess things change. It's funny how someone else's success brings pain. So, as you guys can see, we finished making it. So now we're about to put it in the oven for about 20 minutes to 30 minutes. And then we're going to check on it again. So I'll let you guys know for an update. I took it out the oven and I'm gonna try it really quick. The second layer of dough is actually pretty soft and it's good. I think I'm gonna give it like maybe a nine out of 10. That's pretty good to me. It's better than the box ones that come. But I'm gonna finish eating my food and I will talk to you guys another day have a good night hey y'all i know y'all probably a little confused but today is december 31st and i am currently at my auntie house and it's about to be new years i will check in with you guys when we're going to calm down down on my edges y'all i am fresh off the work that's why i look like this i'm tired but i'm gonna get back to y'all when we're doing the countdown <laughs> Happy New Year. Happy New Year and have a good year. Yeah, okay, okay.
August 15, 2023. The album dropping. The biggest shit there. You heard it here first. Okay. Yeah, we coming hot. What is going on? You hold your leg up, okay? Now, to your brain, left leg, right arm. I saw this morning that I went to the gym with my trainer and then I also got some Jumbo Juice which I'm gonna try on camera because I never really had Jumbo Juice before so let's see what it's giving um I ended up ordering a small white gummy with whey protein so let's see what it's giving I say it's pretty good I will actually try this again. I give this like a 10 out of 10. This is actually very good. It has protein. It's supposed to be healthy. So I will be drinking that again. So that's it for right now. Later, I plan on doing my vision board with my family. So we're going to see how that goes. Just giving you guys a little rundown update for today. Right now, I'm about to get in the shower, get myself together, do some laundry. You guys know I just came from the gym, so I will talk to you guys a little later. Hey, y'all. So today is January 4th, and it's a Wednesday. I know yesterday, you guys, I said I was going to do the vision board. However, y'all, something came up, so we're going to do it today. I have the supplies with me. I'm going to show y'all a little bit of the pictures and stuff I got. So I ended up getting my pictures from Walgreens. And I have so many. Like, I think I printed out maybe like 41. 41, I think. I have a lot. I have a lot I want to get done this year. So, it's a lot. But I am going to set up really quick and then right now I am just going to cut the pictures out, place them on my board how I want them. Then I'm going to glue them down and then after I will explain to you guys um, what I have on my board and what it means to me and what is the goal behind it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention I had a Starbucks drink. It's obviously gone. Um, I also went to the gym this morning, but my Starbucks drink was so good, guys. I ended up getting a brown sugar oat milk with a blonde espresso vanilla. Um, it was pretty good. I gave it a 10 out of 10. It was so good. So good. It's pretty much watered down now, so that's pretty much it. But let's get to the video. Sick of you niggas, y'all contradicting I be so bold myself, girl, you come and fuck me I feel so ordinary to bring you around me Treat me like all the right, where we are Arguments you 
Air me out, tripping about your whereabouts I can't keep no conflict with you, boy, can we just rub it out? I don't want no steady with you, you know you my plug And I can't shake the tab and no I'm in love, baby This is what it's looking like before I glue it. However, I might make some last minute changes. So let's see. I'm about to glue it down. I be so bold myself when you come and fuck me. I feel so ordinary to bring you around me. Treat me like all the right wear me out. All you miss you air me out. Tripping about your whereabouts. I can't keep no conflict with you, boy. Can we just rub it out? I don't want no steady with you. You know you're my plug and I can't shake the tab and no. I'm in love, baby. Hey y'all, so it's a little later and I finally finished my vision board. So I'm gonna show y'all up close what it looked like. So this is my vision board. This is what it looks like. <laughs> you guys so as you guys can see this is my vision board so i'm gonna go over a few of the things that i have on there for 2023 i want it to be great so i made a vision board of everything that i want to happen so i want to go out more and have drinks and then the future is yours to create i have a smoothie because i want to be healthy i have a microphone because i want to start voicing my opinion more just because i want to start being cute getting cute and doing things this quote says live your blank best life and i feel like sometimes i let my anxiety get to me yeah i let my anxiety get to me and i don't go through with things that i have planned so this year i'm gonna live my best life right here we have a picture of a little boy a mom and then somebody standing behind them however the face is blocked out this year as you guys can see i have a few pictures of dates and stuff like that so hopefully this year i will be in a relationship youtube that's my goal as y'all can see the little cameras that i have on here and then we have vitamins because we want to be healthy we have food because we want to eat and cook things um we also have little quotes like i'm confident consistency i also want to live a soft life this year so i don't want to have any anger or any aggression i just want to focus on me and better in me large amount of money put on here because as y'all can see the money calling we get into the bag this year a happy birthday with some decorations this year i hope on my birthday that i get a birthday surprise so we're gonna see and then i also have some water on here Hopefully you guys can see with the glare. And then I have a graduation cap up there. If you guys know, um, in the process of me getting my nursing degree, I am getting a associate's degree in arts and science this semester. So once I finish, I will have that. I have some keys and hopefully the plan this year is to move and for me and Kymir to have our own house. I have mom up here, and the definition is a secret, a keeper, a peacemaker, a teacher, an angel, and then it says potential hero. I just feel like this year, I want to be the best mom that I can be. I have Jesus lens on here because I want to build a better relationship with God. I was little, and I went to church every Sunday. I have family on here because if you know, you know, I love my family. Like, that's my heart, and yeah we have some few designer things on here so we have the we have dior louis vuitton saint laurent um 
And then we have some Chanel bags and such. This year, I kind of want to spoil myself a little more because last year I didn't have a good credit score. Just bid onto it and help it get higher than what it is. Not that my credit score is bad, but it's always room for growth. Then we have a picture of a body and it says, Dear body, you were never the problem. There is nothing wrong with your size, curves, stretch marks. You are enough already. I'm pretty sure you guys know by now I have my son and with that comes a lot of changes and hence why I have some workout pictures on here because I want to work out, get back in shape, um, city lights and some highway signs So I want to do more traveling this year. This quote over here says, I don't chase, I attract what belongs to me, will simply find me. Meaning I'm not forcing anything this year. What God has planned for me and what is written will happen. I won't go against or try to make things work that he don't want for me to work. And yeah, that's pretty much it for my vision board. So that is going to be the end of this video. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, comment below if you made a vision board. Or what did you put on your vision board that you really want to happen this year? Follow me on Instagram at ITSS.NUNU with three U's. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.